as many as said to be settled in marriage, the year 2023 is declared your year. It's declared your year. That general curse is broken today. That but diabolical curse is open to is broken today. That yoke of the wicked is destroyed today. In the name of Jesus Christ. And so shall it be. I decree that today marks a new dawn in your life. All round rest becomes your new experience in life. You not only be a success in your career, you be a success in every area of your life. Your family success will attract many others to Christ. Your spiritual next level will move many others to Christ. In the precious name of Jesus. This week you have a testimony. This week you will have a testimony. This week you will return with a testimony. It's starting from now. It's starting from now. It's starting from now. You know the viability, the liability, the dependability of this mystery. A friend of mine said to me, Brother David, it's time to pray for life partners. I, I don't need it. My own is covered. He said, how? I said, Matthew 33. I knew that time that he covers all areas of life. I knew as a then, in the heat of that revelation, I knew that he covers all areas of life. And he did. So I never prayed for a marriage. I never prayed for who to marry. It was added. Every valuable thing you see in my life today, he added it. He, he added this. I never look for one. He added it. I've been on several prayer episodes. I never asked God for things for me. Jesus, what's the next? Nemonotas, Canarudia, what's the next? Akenko Temo, Elarande, what's the next? My God. We got married, though. No room for honeymoon. No space. What's happening, David? I got a meeting somewhere. And then another somewhere. There were no offerings in those days. You know what I'm talking about? That you went to preach to give you offering for what? For preaching. Thank you, Brother David, for coming. Find your way. <laughs> so there was no material motivation but my heart, panting after God, restlessly but delightsomely. Restlessly but delightsomely. The first week passed. Second week passed. First month, I said, look, what do we want? One week or two weeks or anymore? Or a lifetime or anymore? Lifetime. Oh, no, let's, let's carry on. I've been rolling like this, oh, since those days till now. I was on the feet this week three times looking for souls. Amen. We will return with 760 new converts. 760. I've been jumping around like that since 76. My friend, wake up. When God takes over your areas, your issues, they are over. He takes over your business, pff, over. Takes over your family, it's over. Today must mark the end of struggling over issues that Christ has already taken care of. Can I hear your loudest amen? From your sons and daughters, you will have good news. Yeah. From your grandsons and daughters, you will have good news. Yeah. A woman was with me last Sunday, 87 year old, in the sanctuary, is it? 84, 84 year old, serving the Lord. My mother was in sanctuary keeper till the day she died. Just two weeks before she died, she didn't go there. Life, that's it. It's sweet. It's sweet. It's sweet. In the name of Jesus, you and your spouse will live long together. Amen. Your sons and daughters will do exploits in your lifetime. Amen. No one here will bury any of their children. Amen. You'll never bury your grandchildren. Amen. No one here will die young. A good old age is declared your portion. In the name of Jesus. And so shall it be. Thank you, Jesus. Come on, give him thanks.